In the year 1621, a group of settlers called the Pilgrims traveled from Europe to the New World, a continent they had never known before, in hopes of creating a community free to worship God apart from the strict rules of their old government. For many arduous months, they journeyed across the Atlantic Ocean, enduring violent storms, sickness, food shortages and hopelessness. The expedition was so grueling that many did not survive. When the pilgrims finally arrived in America, their supplies were almost completely depleted, and the settlers were weak and healed. They had no experience in building homes or planting crops, especially in an environment quite different from the one they left behind in Europe. Their hopes of building a community in a new world seems almost impossible when they realized they were unprepared for life in this strange new place. Fortunately for the pilgrims, there was a group of native people living nearby. These Native Americans taught European settlers how to build their homes and plant crops for food. Their friendship saved the lives of the new settlers. They were the answer to all of the pilgrims' prayers for God's help. At the end of the first harvest, the pilgrims invited the Native Americans to celebrate all of God's provision. For three days, the two groups feasted together, celebrating their partnership and the many blessings they had been given. Today, historians have updated ideas about what really happened on that first Thanksgiving. More and more schools are rethinking how they teach the Thanksgiving story to students including multiple perspectives about the way the early settlers treated the Native Americans they met. A closer examination of history suggests the meal was not necessarily a happy one. Over the years, the day known as Thanksgiving became an important tradition in the United States. A day of giving thanks for all that we have 